What's up, my name is Michael, I teach geography, history, a lot of subjects actually, and I'm about to take a geography general knowledge trivia quiz. I thought this could be a fun experiment to see how much I actually know, and also to prove that teachers are not experts at their subjects. We know a lot, but you know, we're not necessarily experts, but I really do hope I get a lot of these right, otherwise this is awkward. And if you want to play along, please let me know down in the comments how many points you got and if you beat me, and if you're one of my students watching this video, please let me know how many points you got because maybe I can improve your grade. Hey, imagine that. All right, without further ado, let's play. All right, quiz channel. If this works out, we might as well do some more videos of this. Let me know if, if, if this is fun. Me no speak English. All right. <clears throat> 25 questions. What is the biggest country in the world? Russia. Easy. I hope all of my students get this right. Otherwise, I'm worried. Boom. One point. I'm writing my points down so I don't forget. Uno. What is the southernmost capital city in the world? New Zealand. Wellington. Boom! Easy! Two for two! I'm good! Obviously, I studied geography, so <laughs> I hope I get some of these right. With 54 countries, which continent has the most countries? That's Africa. A three-pointer, there you go. Place these rivers in order of length, starting with the longest, Amazon, Yangtze, and Nile. Nile is the longest, Amazon and Yang. Mm. See, four points. I promise you, I haven't watched this video <laughs> before. I'm Greenland is an autonomous territory within which kingdom? Denmark. It's an easy one. Boom, Denmark. I can bet my house on it. There you go. We should do this live one day. That, that would be really fun. What is the biggest mountain range in the world? Biggest. Tallest uh, Himalaya, longest uh, Andes. I don't know what they mean by biggest. Andes, I get a point, I guess. What is the most populous country in Africa? Nigeria, about what, 80, 85 million people? Nigeria, we're on a roll, seven out of seven. What autonomous region of China is called the Las Vegas of the East? Uh, Macau? Yes! There you go. I want to go there someday and play the casinos. That would be fun. Angel Falls is the world's highest uninterrupted waterfall. In which country would you find the Angel Falls? Angel Falls. I don't know, an African country, uh, Congo. Venezuela, okay. Didn't get a point, I lost that one. What is the world's biggest ocean? Pacific, that's a point. Boom. <laughs> I'm giving myself points without the answer, but it's the Pacific, easy. If you turn the globe, it just covers the entire, you know, backside of it. It's just blue. It's water. Tasmania is part of which country? Australia. But I'm not giving myself a point until I get the answer because I'm a bit on. It's Australia, isn't it? Yeah, there you go. I'm not even worried. I studied this. What is the world's largest continent? Oh, Asia. It's Asia, isn't it? Hello? I was a bit worried that it would say Africa or something, but yeah, Asia, easy. 
The Caribbean islands of Hispaniola is shared by which two countries? Spain and Portugal? I don't know. Oh, that's so wrong. Dominican Republic and Haiti. All right. What country is completely surrounded by South Africa? Oh, uh, uh, oh no, I know this one, I know this one. Uh, Lesotho, no, yes? Yes! <laughs> Easy. I made a project about Lesotho in, uh, in the university, that's why. Barcelona is the capital of what autonomous region of Spain? Uh, Catalan. Catalan? Catalan? Whatever, however you pronounce it. Boom! Oh, Catalonia. Whatever. That's a point. I lost two points so far. In which country is the ancient city of Petra found? Uh, Jordan. I would really love to visit that one day. It's really cool. Boom! Point. How are you doing? I like this. We're definitely doing this live one day. Mount Everest is on the border of which two countries? Nepal, China? Mm. El Punctu, 15 out of 17. That's okay. What is the biggest country in South America? Brazil. That's a point. It's too easy. We need, a re uh, we need a harder quiz. Hey, I would like to visit Rio, the favelas, but yeah, I'm white, I'm not stupid. What country was formerly, formerly known as Kalon? I've heard about Kalon, but uh, I'm a, I admit defeat. Sri Lanka. Oh. Almost gave myself a point. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, I've heard of it, but forgot. What country is called the land of a thousand lakes? Finland. I think it's Finland. Oh, beautiful. We're doing all right. What is the only continent? with land in all four hemispheres. Africa? Yay. I had to think about that one, but that was an easy one actually. What is the only major city in the world located on two continents? Uh, Istanbul. It's between Europe and Asia. And I've been there on both sides. It's a point for the teacher. <laughs> this is a stupid game, but it's so fun. <laughs> what narrow strait separates the Iberian Peninsula in Europe from Morocco in Africa? Oh, eh, eh. Oh, I know this one. Oh, Gibraltar. Oh, I almost, uh, almost gave myself a point again. No, I knew that one. What is the smallest country in the world? Vatican. Point. It's where the Pope lives, and uh, it has about 200 residents, but it's it's just as big as a city, a small one. Boom, there you go. St. Peter's Basilica. Also known as the Pope's Castle. The Seychelles are part of which continent? I don't know. Uh, Oceania. Oceania, Oceania, Africa. 20 out of 25. How did you do? I want to know. 20 out of 25, how would I rate that? How would I grade that? Uh, that's about, that's, that's an E. Usually when it comes to general knowledge or geography and naming things, it's usually just E. That's what you get. And if you want an A, you have to perform better than that. So I. I passed, I guess. It's good enough. Ayo, hey, I'm making a Discord one day and it would be really fun if someone wanted to play this, uh, if I live streamed it and we could actually 
fight alongside or battle each other on general knowledge, geography, history. Uh, obviously, the subjects that I teach, not, not only because I want an edge, but at the same time, it's cool to be the teacher and it's also, you know, it's awkward if I really fail. Hey, I teach PE as well, physical education. We could do a sports quiz. All right, let me know how you did on this quiz. Uh, and if you want to see another one, because this was a fun thing. And maybe it's something fun for viewers. You could play along and see if you can beat a teacher. 20 out of 25. I could have gotten 21 because I know, I know about Gibraltar, but uh, I lost it. All right, there's nothing else to it. Let me know if you beat me. Without further ado, thank you so much for watching and take care. Bye-bye.